Welcome to Fallout 76, this is Jim, once in a while we get a daily. Scrap jug to produce lead, 10, 250 score. Now lucky for us, lead can be bought at the Tinker's workbench. It is hands down the fastest, quickest, easiest way to complete this daily challenge. And I already have a video on this, but all you do, you go to your Tinker's workbench and you go craft. You down to bulk, you down to bulk lead, and then you craft this and then you scrap it. But in order for this to work, you need lead scrap and plastic in your stash or scrap box. And as I said, I already have a video on that, but I'm going to show you a good place that you can get lead. Quick and easy. I'm going to go right down here to Camden Park, just down the road from one of my camps. Let's head down here. There's going to be some scorched around, but what we are looking for is we're looking for tin cans, okay? And a really good source of tin cans is right here at Camden Park, believe it or not. We'll sneak around here, and we will take care of these scorched. Got it. Okay. Cool. Let's see what they got on us there. Plasma cartridges. Oh, thank you very much. I need plasma, plasma cartridges. So, tin, or lead, sorry. Tin cans. One of the best spots is right here at Camden Park. And as you can see, these can chimes. Okay? So, as you see, when we walk up to them, we can disarm them. And what it does, it grabs them. See, nine tin cans. There's some more tin cans that we grabbed. Let's see how many we got. 18 tin cans, okay. Well, that's a good spot. We'll head down here around the corner. We might have to kill a few more scorch down here. But I just wanted to show you how a really good source of lead. In case you're a new player, in case you don't know and you're low on lead, those tin can uh, chimes there, like they're like, uh, like defense. It's like a uh, really good source of lead. You use lead for weapons. You use lead for uh, ammunition if you're crafting your own. It's it's pretty cool. Where am I at here? So we're on the other side of Camden Park, and again have two more can chimes. So let's grab those. Grab those. Make sure we go under that, underneath that bad boy. <laughs> And then we're going to take a left right through here. Maybe a couple scorched through here, possibly. And as you can see, there's there's two more right there. But we're going to leave them for someone else. Because I don't want to grab too much on this uh, server. Okay. But as you can see, there's two more right there. And same thing, just walk up to it, you disarm. Okay, pretty simple. All right. So let's go ahead, we'll go back to here to this uh, workbench and we'll scrap this stuff. Yeah, this workbench in here somewhere it has to be. Right here. So let's go scrap. So tin can. So just with those, you know, wind can chimes that we uh or chimes that we uh disarmed so one can gives one lead it also gives a good source of steel so let's scrap scrap truck to produce lead 10 for 10 easy and as i said you know you could do it the quick easy way however if you are actually looking for lead and want to do this challenge at the same time camden park definitely are the best spots or if you find a spot where you have where they have those hanging uh, chimes there just grab them scrap them and then you know there's a bunch of other cans that are kind of laying around as well and uh Hinder park is just a real good source of it hope you enjoyed the video please like subscribe and share when you have the chance it really helps me out and i hope you all have a nice day